It's really exciting to be a recipient of um, one of these grants because I think it will help us to do um, start off a research agenda which is very large but which we really think is important and want to get started. And this is the perfect arena of a grant that's on uh, metrics for connecting agriculture, nutrition, and health to do it. Um, so the, the problem that we've identified is basically that um, given the world food situation today, it's possible for everyone to consume enough calories, but it's actually impossible for everyone to consume healthy diets, given even equal is distribution of the food that's available. So um, for a long time, there's been a, a kind of high-level policy goal of reaching uh, adequate access to calories in terms of um, reducing um, undernourishment, which is what's me been measured as a Millennium Development Goal. And uh, so countries track access to calories. And there's also quite a lot of tracking of staple food prices. But what's not tracked effectively is um, availability and prices of the more nutrient-rich non-staple foods, which make up a diverse diet. And um, so food security is you know, access to sufficient nutritious and safe food to meet dietary needs. And so we need to be tracking whether food is available in all kinds of diverse foods for people to actually meet their dietary needs. So what our project does, it's called IANDA, <laughs> Indicators of Affordability of Nutritious Diets in Africa, is we're going to work uh, starting in two countries, in Tanzania and in Ghana, to look at data that is actually already collected by national bureaus of statistics and ministries of agriculture. We think there's a lot of food price data that's out there that's not tapped to understand the prices of diverse foods. So we'd like to work with um, the data collection agencies in these countries and our uh, partner institutions in these countries, which um, include University of Ghana and Sokoine University in Tanzania, to um, connect with these data systems and, and try to create indicators of affordability of um, nutritious diets. Uh, so uh, the, the grant is actually going through Tufts University, and I'm affiliated with Columbia, and we also have, we're partnering with Johns Hopkins University because they have a, an information platform, it's called the National, National Evaluation Platform in Tanzania, where they have collected all kinds of data, um, and nutrition is one area of that where there's a, a real lack of data uh, to inform policy on um, nutrition sensitive aspects like access to nutritious food. So we'd like to work with that platform that Hopkins is running um, in Tanzania to, to start integrating these price indicators into these information systems that are already running.